In the spirit of celebration of Christmas, which is the birth of the Savior, hundreds of children, orphans, and widows of internally displaced persons living in Maraba, Rido, Chikun, local government area of Kaduna State, have sued for love, peace, and end of insecurity challenges confronting the country. The Humanitarian and EcoSmile Support Empowerment Initiative say the IDPs need to be loved and celebrated by all noting that the children have potential to become great leaders while urging the government to end insecurity in the country. This Christmas of hope events just to seek for support for the internally displaced person and also to preach the message of peace out to everyone for people to remember that yes we have some persons that were displaced some persons that were they were expelled from their community because of banditry terrorism tell every displaced child out there every vulnerable child out there that you've not been forgotten that god loves you so much that we love you and then don't forget that you are the future that this country this nation belongs to you and we also want to urge the government to please help us to bring an end to this insecurity if you ask most of the kids here and even the parents they will tell you they want to go back to their communities that they are tired of staying here because where they are coming from they are kings and queens but unfortunately for them see where they are today living at the mercies of the communities where they are so that's why we're begging the government to so please help us bring an end to this insecurity let people go back to their communities also the humanitarian who visited the idps donated items to put a smile on the children orphans and widows faces christmas is a reason of love it's not about me it's not about, about my family it's about giving out and when I think of it, who do I give to? Is it to the rich? No. Is it to the that are okay? No. It's to the less privileged. These people have their homes, they have their parents. Most of them are now orphans, most of them are widows, they are widowers. They were displaced. Now they have to stay in the cold and the sun. So these are the people we have to celebrate with. So that's what brought us here to put a smile on their face and to see to what we can do to actually educate them by supporting them with the educational materials, with uh, writing materials and all the rest. Some of the internally displaced children expressed excitement over the gesture with food attempts to celebrate Christmas. Yes, I'm going to be happy like how I was happy in, in my village. Because of bandage, I'm busy kidnapping everyone. Even here, my daddy stay still, they are busy coming again. They brought some rice and some cartons. And even the, this ice piece they give me. And they are so happy for how they are bringing things for us. And may the Lord bless them. I feel so excited that I think of my community that I left. Bandits chased us from our community and they killed so many of our parents, our aunties, uncles. There was school, but they made us to run and we came here to stay. Because here is not happy like our community. In our community, you see, even though it's night, we'll be sleeping outside, playing, whatsoever, farming. Uh -huh. But here, we don't even have farm, uh, farm to farm. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.